Paris, France. 1158 hours local. Nicholas Woland, known simply as L'Americain, to prisoners and guards alike, sat on the edge of his hard, narrow cot, hands resting idly on his knees. With eyes closed, he began four-count tactical breathing to ready himself, a practice he'd acquired in the army during his ten years of service as a Green Beret. Most of the things he'd learned in his former life he'd jettisoned, the way a space capsule rids itself of a booster rocket once attaining orbit, but some things he'd kept. The tactically useful bits. After two rounds, his pulse slowed and the knots of tension he stored in his neck and heavily muscled shoulders began to relax. Today was the day, and he needed to be both physiologically and mentally prepared to do his part for the plan to succeed. There would be no second chances, 